I feel so free. Like I never film like this. So I just feel so like, like I can just do so many activities. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, I'm Yesenia, also known as Yes. So thank you guys so much for coming on to this video. Please don't forget to subscribe before you go. So for today's video, I have finally, 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 another Yes for Less. And this one is from Target. I did try to film this video like a week ago and I hadn't tried on some of the pieces. And when I tried them on for the video, I realized they were kind of crap and I did not like them. So I was like, mm, I need to go return these things, but I'm actually really satisfied now with the pieces that I did pick up. So yeah, I'm gonna be showing you guys uh, how I style these. I did only get one pair of shoes because nothing else really float my boat. Um, I was gonna say floated in my boat, but that doesn't make any sense. Um, nothing really tickled my pickle. So I will be showing you guys shoes um, that are like, different just so you guys can you know kind of have an idea like how to style it like I said I got one pair of shoes I will be showing them to you guys um but I will be getting very creative with the shoes they're not from Target so just FYI if you are not familiar with my series yes for less it actually started as bougie on a budget but it's where I pretty much go to stores that are inexpensive and just pick up cute stuff because on this channel, we don't like breaking the bank, okay? So, um, yeah, I just want to show you guys um, different kind of outfits that you guys can put together without spending hella money, okay? Because who can relate, obviously, you know what I mean? Um, so, yeah, that is what we are going to be doing today. I do have complete outfits for you guys. So, if you guys want to check out what I picked up at Target and how I style it, then please keep watching. I'm here with my brother. And we are doing some shopping at Target because you guys wanted to see a yes for less at Target. And so that is what we're doing this morning. And we're at the Graphic Tees and they're on sale. All right, guys. So I've worn this, oh, this one before. And a lot of people asked me where I got it and I got it here. Um, and I already have it, so I'm not going to get it. But yeah, in case you were wondering. Your girl had to come to the clearance section. Oh, yellow. Yes. These are super cute, too. All right, so they have this brand called Wild Fable and I'm not mad at it, okay? Good stuff, good stuff. Okay, so they even have these like trendier, like you know, like the grandma shoe right now, but they don't have them in my size, otherwise I would get them. And these are a little bit dirty, but you guys, these are pretty cute, um, but they don't have a huge selection. All right guys, so first let's talk about the jeans that I picked up. So first off, yes, Wild Fable come through. Um, they kind of saved the Target Yes for Less, if I'm completely honest. Um, because when I was looking through the regular section, I guess that's not the Wild Fable section, um, I saw some jeans that were like 27 to like $35, and I was kind of like, what? Like that's, that's not Yes for Less status, okay? That's a little bit too much, um, especially because it's not like a brand name. It's not like Levi's or I don't know, whatever other brands there are. Um, it's like Target, so I was kind of like, yo, I don't know if this Yes for Less is gonna work out. The jeans just seemed very overpriced, very basic, not very trendy. So then when I went over to the Wild Fable side, I was like, yes, Wild Fable, you guys really saved the yes for less because these were actually only $20, um, which is, it's, I mean, it's fine, it's decent, um, especially because they are like more trendy jeans, they're high-waisted, they're not just like super basic, like generic jeans. Um, so come through Wild Fable. These are high-rise skinny jeans and they have no distresses in them. So you guys, if you guys follow my channel or my Instagram, you guys know that uh, this is very new for me, okay? This is probably like the second or third pair of non-distressed jeans that I've purchased in the last maybe like year or two. Um, just because, yeah, I love my distress, but um, I really like the color. I feel like this would be really cute with like um, white. And like I said, they are skinny bottoms. And these are actually in a size 4. I feel like their sizing is a little bit different if you would i picked it up in a size four a size two fits me at the waist but everything else is just way too tight um but the only trouble that i have with these at the waist is a little bit loose um so i will have to like either go get it altered or like wear a belt with it but for 20 dollars, honestly i'm not mad at it and they are really high-waisted which i really really like um because we only do uh high-waisted jeans if you guys are new to my channel only high-waisted jeans around here okay we will not be following that low cut uh, i don't even remember what it's called trend i never thought that was cute and i remember when stores finally kind of started selling high-waisted i think i was like i don't know maybe like five years ago 
um, when it kind of started becoming a thing. I was so excited because when I was younger, I didn't really know high waist, low waist. Like I didn't really know about the trends, if you would. I just knew that I loved the way that I looked in high waisted. It just flattered my body so much better um, because like low rise, I feel like that doesn't flatter anything. But um, anyways, high waisted in this household, okay? All right, so these next jeans are also from Wild Fable. Like I said, come through Wild Fable. They really came through. Um, and these actually do have some distresses on them, but it's like the kind of distress that you can't really, really see the skin. So it's very like minimal, very uh, like not the most, like most of the jeans that I wear. These are also skinny and these are actually shorter, which you guys will see in the next shot. Um, but they are also high waisted and you guys will see that um, they also do not fit my waist all the way so i'll probably have to get them altered but i absolutely love the fit of these jeans i feel like they just are so nice and like the quality feels really nice and it also feels stretchy and stretchy is a must for me so i really really am glad that i purchased these all right so this is the first top that i picked up and as you guys can see it has like this square neck thing that I like. I feel like this is really cute, especially for like my Instagram videos or just like my YouTube videos. I especially like finding shirts that are like cute at the neck area here because that's kind of like all you usually see, except for today. Today you can see a lot more. But um, yeah, so it is a long sleeve. It's like, it's an interesting cut because it's not a crop top, but it's also not a regular top. I mean, I guess it is kind of cropped, but I feel like they do this so that way you can tuck it into your high-waisted jeans, which I do like. Um, so this piece right here was nine dollars and it is from the wild fable section and i got it in a size small all right guys so here i styled the red top and the light wash denim jeans the crop was enough for me to tuck it in which was perfect and i styled this with some leopard booties from miss lola which i really like you guys i've grown to be obsessed with these jeans i'm actually wearing them right now <laughs> All right guys, so here we have pretty much the same exact shirt but in a black. Obviously I needed to have it in a black because you kinda need to have everything in a black, you know? Um, it is also Wild Fable, it was the same price, except for I got this one in an extra small because that's all they had. Um, but their sizing is very interesting because the small kinda fit me like a medium and I was surprised that the extra small fit me because usually the girls will not fit in an extra small. They usually are just like, just not cute not flattering and when i put this on i was like what this fits perfectly so when i had first bought it i was like i'm probably gonna, just gonna have to wear it without a bra otherwise it's just gonna squeeze me too much but it fit perfectly so their sizing is definitely a little bit different i have another shirt that it's an extra small and i'm like yo this fits like a medium um so just be aware of that when you guys purchase wild fable i feel like their sizing is a little big but anyways it's pretty much the same thing it's just in a black, I've worn it before and it looks really nice and you guys will see in the next clip how I styled it. Um, but yeah, I'm digging this shirt. All right guys, so these dark denim jeans, I have absolutely been loving. Honestly, there's something about the material of the jeans that just hugs your body really nicely and just makes you look really good. Um, and I also like that at the ankles, it's kind of like a crop almost. So that way those look really, really cute with pumps. These pumps are also from Miss Lola. All right, so next up, you guys know that I had to pick up a band tee. I absolutely love Target for band tees. They have all kinds of different, not even band tees, but graphic tees. Um, and I wanna say they're like from 12 to like uh, $15, which is not bad at all. This one right here cost me $12.99. So, and you guys know that I freaking love Queen. So when I found this in my size the second time that I went, I was living. But I'm really liking how it has like these neutral tones and it has the red. Um, I don't know, I just, I have this thing about band tees just because, first of all, I get to wrap my favorite band. I could dress it up and down, um, but also, like, they usually have, like, different colors, so you can really play around with the shoes that you wear, you could wear sneakers, you could get really creative and wear different boots or, like, whatever, so I think that's my favorite part is that they're comfortable, they're casual, but you can dress it up or dress it down. <sighs> So I picked this shirt up in a size medium, um, and I would say that it is a 
it's not it doesn't run small this runs normal because it is just like the target brand i guess well it says queen but um yeah i wanted to get a large because i usually get my panties large um to make sure that i can wear them as a dress but this one right here works as a dress you will have to wear under uh underwear <laughs> i mean i hope you wear underwear um you have to wear shorts underneath um and i am 5'1 so i wear a medium and it still like covers properly do wear shorts just in case um but yeah for me i never do small band tees just because i'm either gonna do like long past the butt or we're gonna do all the way high waist with band tees like there's no in between for me oh my god one of my favorite outfits i decided to wear the queen shirt as a t-shirt dress and paired it with these sickening snake print boots you guys they're slouchy they're thigh high they are everything i'm obsessed you can also pair this maybe with some leggings or you could dress it down and maybe wear it with some sneakers please let me know if you guys would like to see a how to dress band tees or how i style band tees because i'm so down also, just PSA, I live in oversized clothes. This one right here is an extra large. Um, just because, like I said, it either like covers the butt or it's like above. Like there's hardly an in-between. I don't like my butt being out. Like if it's gonna be out, it's gonna be out. If it's not gonna be out, it's not gonna be out. You don't get no sneak peeks, you know what I mean? So this is one of the shirts that I got uh, when I went the second time around and I'm so glad that I picked it up because it is just so cute. I absolutely love it. I feel like this, Fonts is just so nice. This is really nice. The shirt and everything. The only problem that I have with this shirt is the awkward length. Like it's not, again, it's not like a crop top really, but it's not like a regular top. Um, so I don't like the way that this fits, especially when I wear it with high-waisted jeans, which is what I usually like to wear my crop tops with just because I feel like that flatters my body the most. It makes it look like I have more hips. It doesn't make me look you know, square. Um, and so I will definitely be cutting this. So when you guys see the next clip, this will most likely be cut just because I am not feeling uh, the way that this looks. So the Pontiac, all this is gonna go. Although it's cute, I wish we could have like moved that up, but I just do not like the fit of it. Um, this is in a size extra small. You guys see this? It's an extra small, yo. This looks like a medium. And so, I mean, for anybody who's even like smaller, I, like it's gonna be a little bit oversized on you so that's just the only thing that I'm kind of like uh, whoa about the sizing is that I swear when I saw this I was like that's I'm grabbing that that's a medium but then I looked at it it's an extra small um, but this shirt right here I got for $14.99 which I think is a pretty good price for a graphic tee um, although they did have some other ones that were not as cute and they were the same price but this one right here I feel like was a good one to pick up all right guys, so as you guys can see, I cropped it a little bit more. Would have loved to keep more of the graphic, but the cut was just not cutting it for me. Um, and then I decided to wear my light wash jeans and these actually look really cute with some sneakers. Like you can see here, I rolled up the bottom a little bit just to kind of give it that cute summer look. All right, so right here we have another yellow, like oversized kind of like sweater. This one is, again, it has like the strange crop. It's not like super long, but it's not like super cropped. So this is like nice because you can tuck it into your high-waisted jeans and it won't look super like fat because you don't have like a bunch of like fabric in there. Um, so this you can just kind of like tuck in. It would look cute with like a belt or something. And I got this which is like a change for me. I don't really get anything with a v-neck, especially like t-shirts or just regular tees. I never do v-neck. Um, but I was like, let's switch it up. I have a bunch of these that kind of go like up here, which I really like. Um, but yeah, this is more like a mustard yellow. Obviously, you can really compare it because I have more of like a bright neon yellow and then this is more like a mustard yellow so this right here is also from wild fable um and it was seven dollars and fifty cents because you know your girl went really hard on the clearance section just because clothes can be a little pricey at target um for what it is because how do i explain so it's not that like the clothes is expensive but i feel like for some of the prices like i can get a lot more like at marshall's or ross or burlington you know what i mean so it's not like oh wow like I'm a cheap ass and I don't want to purchase that, you know? If it's really nice, I'll buy it, but sometimes I'm kind of like, uh, I feel like I could find something better elsewhere, like something that's a like brand name or anything like that. Um, so this was regular $15, which is honestly not bad at all. Um, but I'll, I think I have an example over here of other things. 
All right, guys, I'm loving this color combo. The yellow and the light wash jeans is just giving me so much life. I decided to dress this down a little bit and wear it with these white Nikes. You can also wear any other white sneaker, or you can also dress it up by wearing some kind of booty, some kind of heel. Um, but like I said, I am loving this combo, okay? Yes, come through color. All right, so the next shirt that we have is a high-waisted crop top. <laughs> high-waisted crop top, that's definitely not it. It is a turtleneck crop top is what I meant to say. It's not like a crazy turtleneck, you know, with a really fat neck, but it's just kind of like, I don't know, is there a name for this? Like a medium turtleneck or something? I don't know, but um, it is a little bit more cropped than most of the other um, pieces that I got, but it's definitely still that like awkward length crop, but it's probably just because not everybody wants to wear their shirts like really up here, which is how I like to wear them when I wear my high-waisted jeans because that's just how I feel my body looks best. Um, but yeah, it's like a kind of like a see-through fabric. I did wear this already and it's not that warm. So if you're like in the cold weather or anything and you're planning on just wearing this, you're probably gonna need like a coat or something because it is like that see-through, um, like you can feel everything inside material. Um, so this right here is also Wild Fable. It's in a size medium. And this actually goes for $20, but I got it on sale for 10. If it was $20, honestly, I don't think I would have purchased it because I feel like it's just, it's a little basic for $20. I feel like I could have picked something up else, or that doesn't even make sense. I feel like I could have picked something, ugh, why can't I talk? I feel like I could have picked else something, what? I feel like I could have picked something else up for that price. So this is a Wild Fable shirt and it is in a size medium. And I actually got it on sale for $10, which is why I picked it up because it was regularly 20. And I don't think I would have bought this for $20. Honestly, I just feel like there's, I mean, it's cute for $10, but for 20, I feel like there's like nothing very special about it. Like that's like $20, you know? So, um, yeah. All right, so here is the crop top turtleneck. This one would look cute, honestly, with either these jeans or the other darker wash jeans. And I did pair these with these really cool white snake print booties from Miss Lola. All right, guys, so this next sweater right here is like a very like fluffy, nice material. As you guys can see, it's like that super soft, like, it almost looks like it's gonna fall apart kinda, but it's like really soft. But it's not actually falling apart, it's just like that material that looks like you can like just pull it off. Um, but I actually got this in a size large and it is not Wild Fable, which, which is why I feel like it's more expensive. I feel like Wild Fable is kinda like cheaper and trendier. I mean, I'm not sure, but from the pattern that I'm seeing here. Um, so this is regularly $30, which is like a fat no for me. Like I just don't, like I just, I don't, I don't see it. I don't see the $30 here, um, but it was on sale for $14.98, which is why I picked it up. Um, and like I said before, it's not that I'm trying to be like a cheap ass or anything. Like if it was, like I feel like if it was worth $30, I would purchase it, but I feel like for $30, I can get like this for 15, like at Ross or something, you know what I mean? Um, I know a lot of you guys did comment and were like, Target isn't really like yes for less because it is a little bit more like on the pricier side. Um, because it can add up, trust me, getting an outfit at Target can add up, but I really feel like the Wild Fable section kind of came through because things seem to be more trendier and, um, a little bit more inexpensive. So, um, this is not Wild Fable, which is why I'm thinking it's a little bit pricier, but I did get it in a large surprise, surprise, because this I would wear with, um, some either really, really tight jeans or some, uh, some leggings, why can't I think? Um, but yeah, I feel like this is just kind of like very cute, very simple, you know, very chill, very like, I tried, but not really because I'm wearing leggings, you know what I mean? All right guys, so I love this look right here because it's pretty chill, pretty casual, but I feel like the booties just kind of give it that like, oomph, I really tried. Uh, but this right here, you can also wear with some thigh highs. You can even maybe pull it off as a dress if you want. Definitely have to wear some shorts underneath, but for sure you can wear with some leggings and make it look really cute. So then we have this baby right here, which is the last shirt that we have. And it's exactly like the black one. It is that like see-through material. Um, it does have that high neck and that like 
crop top here. Um, so I like these because I feel like they're just like a staple for your wardrobe in the winter time. And like I said, they were only $10. Um, so I feel like this is just something that you can just throw on and it'll look cute with some high-waisted jeans, some boots or something, and you just kind of fix up your hair, accessorize. Um, and I feel like you can really like pull it together and it's only 10 bucks, so. All right, guys, so I love the combination of this dark wash color and this red. Here we have a more chill outfit. It's not too chill, but it's also not too dressy. I feel like we have a good combo because we have the sneakers, but we also have a crop top turtleneck. You know what I mean? So it's like not too casual, not too sporty. It's like the perfect combo. All right guys, so the last thing that I picked up from Target are actually these shoes right here, which I really, really like. I feel like they're super cute. When I first saw them, I was kind of like iffy, but then I feel like the colors kind of grew on me. Um, I feel like it's kind of like that trendy, like sock inspired shoe, if you would. Um, they did have these other shoes. I'm sure you guys saw them in the beginning clip that are like that grandpa like style shoe, but they didn't have any of my size. I would pick them up just to show you guys like how I would style them and everything, but they didn't have my size, but they did have these right here. Um, and these were actually only $15, which I was pleasantly surprised about. I was kind of bummed because I was like, I don't see any shoes that I like. And then I saw these and they were 30 and I was kind of like, Eh, I guess I'll get them just, you know, to give them options and show them. But they, they were actually on clearance for 15 So, you know, your girl was really happy. Um, but I really like the colors that they chose. I like that it has, like, the pink on here. has the red, the yellow, the blue. I just feel like it's, like, a really, really fun, like, shoe. And it's kind of, like, trendy and everything. And I feel like you wouldn't really know that you picked this up at Target. So, I think this right here and then this top. Do you guys see which one it is? And the queen top are definitely like my favorite purchases that I picked up. Um, so yeah. All right, so here they are on. I absolutely love them, you guys. Not only are they really cute, but they're really comfortable. And I don't know, I just grew to really, really like them. I feel like over the time that I had them sitting there, I just fell in love. All right, guys, so that is it for today's video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it. You guys know that I absolutely love putting outfits together that are very inexpensive and affordable for everybody. So please let me know in the comments down below if there is any store that you want me to do my next Yes For Less video on. I do have my mind on a few online stores that I really want to do. And also let me know if you guys want me to do like, I don't know, like there's like fashion challenges that are like the clearance challenge or like, $100 outfits challenge or whatever. I don't know. You guys probably know, but let me know down below in the comments what you guys want to see from me next. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Love you guys so much, and I'll talk to you guys next time.